What is going on? What's going on? What's going on? Yeah, what's going on? That was a switch up. I was going in one direction with the song and ended up somewhere else. Anywhere. Uh, anyway, whatever. Hey, y'all. What's up? Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Um, I am on whatever episode I'm on and I'm so excited because you guys continue to follow me through this and I am excited about it. So first things first, this will conclude the last of my cozy sweaters. Let's go ahead and jump on into this one. It has pockets. Boom, boom, boom. I paired it with this hat. Y'all probably tired of seeing this hat, but I don't have a haircut, so I'm looking a little crazy. So y'all just gonna have to deal with this haircut. No haircut and this hat. But it looks good with my little cheetah friend. I got pockets, I got pockets, pop pockets, pop, 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 pop pockets. <laughs> so don't y'all like this? So I'm gonna just, I'm gonna be shouting out a bunch of different people, uh, me and my sister actually have this, and I'm just glad we have yet to bump it to each other wearing it on the same day. I'm so glad uh, because I will be like, awkward. So, yes, this concludes my last little bit of my cozy sweaters, uh, cozy sweaters for these episodes. Um, also, I am doing two wines in honor of Thanksgiving. And uh, happy Thanksgiving Eve. You know, if I might take a quick moment to just say, people are literally dying every day. And we need to love on each other as much as we can before we don't have the opportunity to ever do it again. So this is me telling y'all, I love all y'all. And if nobody else tells you, you just heard it from me. I love y'all, y'all important, and you do mean something to somebody. So now that I've all got the little sappiness out the way, uh, it's Thanksgiving Eve. So I chose two different sweet wines just because I thought they were fun, they were quirky, and I just wanted to try something different. So, some requests. This is a St. James. And, um, no, it's a St. Julian. I'm sorry. So, I thought this was St. James when I got it because it was sitting right next to the St. James section. So, this was supposed to be for Craig and Alex. But, I guess I'm going to have to do a St. James one because this is not St. James, it's St. Julian, or Julian, or Julie somebody, whoever. So let me get up on it. It's PB and J. And it is 10.5%. It has the scoop. So you see that little dip? So I'm excited because it has that little dip. So that means it might be doing something. This, however, is a twist top. So um, let's go ahead and dive on in. It's a PB and J, so it might be weird, but in in gross, or it might not be. But I'm ready to just dive in and check it out. So I'm gonna get the glass, slide this other one back. Let me slide back. I look a little wide. Sorry, y'all. <laughs> Took it off. And already I can tell that it is very watery. It's, um, from the look of it, it's giving me very <laughs> grape juice. But, um, the bleed on the side of it, it's not, it's not bad. It, normally it's watery, but the bleed is, it's kind of thick. I'll, I'll give it to you, let you see it. And my glass look a little dirty. I'm sorry, y'all. Well, anywho, 
I'm very transparent with y'all. I mean, y'all, y'all all up in my house. So I mean, you know, hey. Um, it has a peanut buttery smell to it. I'm gonna just dive in. It's different. Honestly, y'all, I don't hate it. I'm gonna try it again. It, um, it does give me a grape wine taste. It gives me a grape wine taste with a small afterbite of peanut butter. It's a very, very hint, faint, peanut butter aftertaste but um it's not bad it's 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 really it's weird it's really weird uh it, it just works it honestly it works so i would give this saint julian julian saint julian Julie, whoever, I'm sorry, uh, Saint Julien. Julien, you gotta say it like that. Saint Julien. I would give this wine, um, I'd give it about a 7.5, 8. A 7.5, 8 to an 8. It's not bad. I would, I really probably wouldn't pair this with anything because it's, uh, it just doesn't, as of right now for me tasting it, it doesn't seem like it would pair well. It, it, it won't pair well, so I don't know. But uh, I'm going to jump right on into the next wine. Actually, let me clear my palate. I'm going to have a little bit of water. Y'all like my mug? Y'all, one of my really good best friends bought me this mug. And I, I love it. I have such the mug collection that is it's actually really ridiculous. That's a different story for a different day. But if y'all want to see more of my mugs, let me know. Because I don't mind sharing. So this next one is called, it's an Oliver brand. And it's um apple pie. It's an apple wine with natural flavors. So, the alcohol content on this one is a 8.3. And, ooh, it is a cork wine. Uh, it has a cork in it, which I wasn't prepared for that. So, let me just go ahead and grab what I need real quick. And let's dive right on into it. Of course, you take that. I sit it down. Grip it. Boom, boom. Boom. Jump on into that. Y'all, is this wine trying to embarrass me? I think this is wine trying to embarrass me, y'all. Let me let it out some. I'm gonna start it up here. There we go. Boom. So, let's take a look at the cork. It has a little bit of detail on it. All right. I'm using my gather glass because it's 
the day before Thanksgiving. And uh, I think it's adorably cute. Let's go ahead and pour. Again, this is a sweeter wine and it's not giving a good bleed on the side, which is okay. Um, it's a faint smell um, of a little, a hint of sweetness, a little hint of sweetness. Let's taste it and give it a try. I don't hate it. I really thought that I was not gonna like this. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. Uh, I thought I wasn't gonna like it. I really thought I was not gonna like this. It's a uh, apple pie. It's sweeter. It has a little bit of a um. It has a little bit of a like a fizz bubble to it, so it's more. It kind of ha has a fizz bubble, like a Prosecco, almost, um, but it's sweet. It's not super sweet. It doesn't taste like apple pie. Now, I'm kind of glad because I thought it was going to be a fool, and it's not. So, it doesn't taste like apple pie. I'm really glad about that. But it's not bad. Um, I'd give this one about a six. A six to seven. I don't hate it. I don't love it. Uh, but it's not bad. I would definitely pair this with something sweet. Not super, super sweet, but I would pair it with something sweet. And um, it's just a chill, relaxed wine. Both of these actually give me very chill, relaxed, you know, vibes, basically. So that is the conclusion for my wine tasting reviewing portion of this episode but as promised i told you guys there's a lot a lot a lot going on in the month of december so i am going to be doing an advent calendar i'm so i'm crazy excited about that so let me see can y'all see that so this is an advent calendar. Every single day for 24 days, there is a different bottle of wine. I'm excited. 24 bottles of wine. That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. So I'm going to be sharing this with you all. And on the days that... It lands on a Wednesday. I'm going to actually do a tasting of that Wednesday wine. So if you guys also want to see what the other wines are, I'm going to be uploading them to my uh, Instagram. I now have an Instagram. It is Terrell Taste. So every single day in January, I'm going to be up loading a new bottle of wine and that's going to be crazy that's going to be crazy also i told you guys for the month of um december i'm going to be doing giveaways well the first giveaway uh and i probably choose them uh the first or the second week so just bear with me uh in how i'm going to be getting it out to you guys if you're not here locally in st louis or if you're somewhere else, whatever the case is, I'm going to make sure that I get it to you. So, this is going to be one of the giveaways. This is what I call a liquor lamp. I make these, and these are currently for sale. But this is a custom lamp that I'm just giving and gifting away. And I'm also going to, pre I'm also going to make sure that with this lamp, you're going to get a wine bottle opener as well. So that's going to be super dope. This, the wine bottle opener, 
and you will receive one of these here. This is the foil cutter. How this works, it's a battery pack attached to it. Boom, bada ba boom, boom, boom. So that's, that's dope, right? Tell me y'all don't love this. Tell me y'all don't love this. A liquor lamp. That's adorable. So, how I know you guys also are wondering, how do I get this? Well, I need you to first make sure that you like this video. You are following me on my YouTube channel. Go to my Instagram, like that page, and like the like my first picture. Follow that Instagram, and then share that page on one of on your story or somehow, and then post done under the first picture. So I'll repeat it again. To get this here, you have to like this video. Make sure you are subscribed to my YouTube channel. Go and like my first picture on my Instagram page. Follow my Instagram page and also share my Instagram page on your story and make sure that you tag me in it so I know that you actually did it. Once you do it, I want you to type done underneath the first picture. And then I'm going to randomly out of everybody, take everybody's name, write it down, fold it up, and I'm going to put it in a fishbowl and pull it and draw it. And I will let you guys know as soon as it's done. So you're going to have from today till next Wednesday when I pull the name. I'm going to repeat it one more time. Like this video. Follow my YouTube channel. Go to my Instagram page. Like my first picture. Follow my Instagram page. Then share my Instagram page on your story. Tag me in it. Once you tag me in it, make sure you type done underneath your the first picture of my Instagram page. I'm so excited. I can't wait to see who actually gets picked. I can't wait to see how much support you guys are going to give me on this because I'm so passionate about it and I love it. And I'm going to be sharing everything with you guys. Like this whole advent calendar situation, I'm so crazy excited about that. I'm excited about it. So until next week, because the video then got a little lengthy, until next week, I will see you guys. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Until next time. Peace. <laughs>